No one wants a boring, clean guitar with no effects. Even people's clean guitar settings have some effects on them. So let's go ahead and take a look at this guitar pedal right here. Okay, let's move along and get a little bit funky with uh, the Ottawa pedal. Uh, this Ottawa is called the Auto Funk, and it's technically a filter, but um, what this does, it it emulates and uh, pretty much does kind of like what a regular wah pedal does, which is like, of course, if you've ever seen, um, everyone knows who Shaft is, come on. And you all know the theme song where it's like that sexy guitar, funky guitar part. So that's what a wah pedal does, where it kind of like brings in that in and out sound. But the thing is, a, wah, a regular wah pedal, you need to be... Uh, playing it with your foot simultaneously while you're strumming. So since this is a software instrument built in within GarageBand, that's kind of hard to, you can't really put your foot against GarageBand and just start using a pedal. So that's why they've created an auto funk pedal, which kind of does it, does it on its own. So you don't need your foot. Um, so let's take a, let's take a listen how it sounds by default setting. <laughs> and in my opinion, I think it's pretty badass um, how the default sounds. Let's take a listen. Okay, as you can see, it's not perfect, but for a software that's trying to just kind of guess by default, of how a wah is playing and how you're strumming, that's pretty, pretty, pretty close. And um, so, I mean, you can definitely uh, fine tune it and fix the sensitivity and the cutoff. What the sensitivity is, is how, how hard you're strumming. Um, so based on that, if you raise up the sensitivity, obviously uh, the less harder you're gonna have to play. If you lower it, vice versa, um, if you lower the sensitivity, the harder you're going to have to play. Um, the cutoff is, that also has to do with how hard you play as well. Because if you don't strum it hard enough and it doesn't reach that cutoff point, then it's not going to create that effect. So um, let's just mess with the sensitivity and turn it up a little bit more. Hear how that sounds. <laughs> Instantly, you can't really get that wah sound because sensitivity is just way too high. Um, so let's lower it down to about there. Let's hear how that sounds. So I had to really play pretty hard um, because the sensitivity is just so low um, just to get it to burst out. Now, if you mess with the sensitivity versus the cutoff together, you can probably get um, a better sound. Like I said, fine tuning it. Just take your time. Be patient with these uh, these knobs and these pedals. Um, let's lower the cutoff. If you lower the cutoff as well as the sensitivity together, it should uh, work well. Let's take a listen. So, that one I kind of had a press it or I had to strum pretty hard near the end of it to get it to come out to burst out of that that like um, cutting off point so again you're gonna have to mess with these both knobs um, the auto auto funk is, is kind of a hard one that's why I really like the default so my advice would be to be is just start from the default setting and then just really fine-tune it with whatever um, pattern you're playing versus how hard you're strumming and you should be good to go from there. Um, let's mess with a couple of these uh, little slider options right here, which are kind of like just little effects things. They um, they kind of don't do much besides this up and down one. I think the up down is kind of cool, but let's mess with this one. Actually, let me put these back to default, which is about halfway. And then, okay, let's listen. And I'm going to slide that back.
All right, and let's slide over here to high, from slide it to low to high. And hear how that sounds. As you can hear, it's uh, it's definitely a lot higher frequencies, so that's what that does. And let's do the up down. Slide that back to up. So the up kind of does the opposite of down, obviously. Um, it pushes the signal down versus up. And that's kind of basically what the auto funk does. So please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. And if you have any requests, please send them to requests at mahalo.com. Oh!